So I heard there's a famous barber here who does a lot of hair. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Hiya. Good to see you. This is the hey, Alaikum. Why do you look so familiar? Southside Hershey. Southside Hershey. Look at this guy. Okay. How you doing? From Facebook to the haircut. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I'm good. 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 How are you? Good to see you. You too. How's Toronto? Yeah. Amazing. It's good to see you. Welcome back. Famous, Welcome famous back. barber shop here. This is so cool. Welcome. Oh, thank you. Thank you. It's amazing. Hey, so welcome. Come say hi in the camera. So you're taking a, a picture with haircut? It's stress free. It's stress free. Yes, how are you? I'm around? good. I'm good. So beautiful. Alhamdulillah. How are you? Celebrity Ron. Mashallah. Let me kill I don't know about that. I had the convenience of Ron. I don't It's stress free. Stress free? Yeah. Wow. Good stress. I will hide. Stress free Sundays. That's what we need. Yeah. I open place. We're here. Soon. Wallahi. Wallahi. Good for you. Yeah, yes. Is, it, is there a lot of stress? Next time. Uh, Alright. So wait, look, I need to do I need to do a video with Southside Hirsi. Wait for him. You know Southside Soma. Yeah, yeah. Hi, how are you? How are you? Huh? You too. Yeah. What did you say? Yeah, Carmen. Caramel. caramel. Oh, well. uh, okay. Well, Is it caramel well, or caramel? Caramel. Well, like the caramel DJ you eat? Caramel. Oh, you're a DJ caramel? Yeah. Oh, for the mall. Yeah. <laughs> are, you the, are you the DJ for the mall? They already know. Hodanale at the barbershop. What you saying, Hodanale? Welcome to Minneapolis. Assalamu alaikum. This is the life we live, guys, from TV to Snapchat 24 hours a day. Yeah, I already know, at the barbershop. No, sorry. <laughs> did you Snapchat Kanan earlier? Yes, I did. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Are you How we're exciting? Friends? No, somebody told me. Are you on Snapchat? Anything? I'm on Snapchat, but I don't know if that's it. So, anyways, it looks like Kanan was here earlier today, um, our most famous Somali in the world, maybe. Is Kanan the most famous Somali in the world? I think so. Something like that. You think so? Yes. More than Iman, so. who's worth so. like eighty million dollars? I don't think so. I don't know. Just kidding. <laughs> How we forget Iman? Kanan, Iman. Kanan Which one? is most the humblest dude I've ever met. He's more he, famous than Iman. He is. Um. Uh. Well, for now, right now, he is. <laughs> the dude is is, 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 is a true okay. Somali. Well, I, no, 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 no. I love you, Kainan. You're the best of the best. When you come to Minneapolis, make sure you come here so we can drink some Somali shah and organic ambulu too. You already know. Yes, I, I heard there's a Somali shah place. <laughs> I need to go there to, and see you. how it's made fresh. I'm telling you, the, 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 the halwa is here. Ambula is here. <laughs> Ambula. <laughs> <laughs> Finally. Ambula is Somali organic food, and you, that, that you need to go and buy it. It builds your muscles. <laughs> For brothers who go to gym, it's very. Now, what about advice. camel milk? Any camel milk? Camel milk no. upstairs. At yeah, yeah, we have we have they have milk. camel milk yeah. here. Oh we my do. god. Really? Camel meat. I don't know what white people eat. But. Can, can, I, can I ask you a question? Yeah, I have one question to ask. Do you see any non-Somalis besides only you only hang out with Somalis? I'm telling you, a lot of uh, non-Somalis come here and eat our sambus. Mm. When is you go, you know, Absolutely. hanging out with Somalis, you can't go back. <laughs> Once you go Somali, you never go back. You never, you know, <laughs> once you hang out with Somalis, you never go back to another. I mean, like. When people get out of work, it's yeah. here that they come and they socialize. Yeah, I'm just surprised there's so many people yeah. just hanging out here. Like, it's, yeah. it's a home. party. This yeah. is home, and they it's where we send money back home. This is where we get our, you know, shoes, our clothes, tailored, our food, uh, restaurants. How long have you been an owner here? I've been here for the last five years. Wow, amazing. Yeah. Yeah. This is good. You know, that the interaction is very positive. What do people talk about? Like, you know, most barbers are like psychologists. Yeah. So what problems I do mean, you hear? People talk about <laughs> back home, Somalia, what's going on here, what's going on there. No marriage problems? Um, <laughs> a lot of marriage problems. <laughs> a lot of marriage problems, I'm telling you. But, you know, people come and tell you everything at the barbershop. You know, barbershop is just a place where people let it go. Do you, do you find that you are basically helping them when you're cutting their hair too? Like I'm, nourishing them, I'm giving more, them advice? Well, I'm more like, do you give good advice or uh, bad advice? Well, I try to mingle with them and give them positive. I'm more like a therapist to Barbara. <laughs> That's what I said. He's an unofficial that. therapist. Yeah, it's really nice to have What's the book. biggest problem you heard? The Let biggest, me, yeah. Oh, the biggest problem I heard is one guy, he brought his wife from Africa and he brought her here 
and then when he when he brought her here, she she uh, liked a car outside her house, which was his his neighbor's. She was like, if I don't get some kind of car like that, it's the sex of the time it would go in out of way. Oh, you know, our ladies over a car. Over a car. So I'm not saying all Somali ladies are bad. <laughs> Some of us are, you know what I'm saying, like this, like this. So what this is I, what Willie men talk about the barbershop, <laughs> which is sisters. women. <laughs> we don't, no, we don't talk about women all the Dogging time. Dogging women out all the time. Yes, come on, you guys, be honest. You guys, you guys <laughs> don't lie. Organic. Winter is coming. We need, we need, you know, people to get married exceptionally, uh, you know. Uh, winter is coming. People, get somebody. You know. <laughs> Rate of marriage at winter time? Yeah, it goes up. Way high. Summer time Summer is too time hot. Break you up? know, get out of my life. I don't like you. Oh you know, some other way. <laughs> But I'm going to Somalia to get married, organic, low mileage female. Low With six pack natural, you know what I'm saying? I'm telling you. Like Sir Mike. Hold on, Ali. No, I'm telling you. So you're not married, you're going back to Somalia? I'm, I'm, I will be I'm still here. People think I'm 20, but I'm 17. They kind of mix it up together. Yeah. I'm, I'm so, so what are you going to marry? Like a 10 year old? What not, are you saying? Not 10 year old. But I'll marry a woman <laughs> with, no, with no backgrounds on Facebook or Snapchat, organic woman. Uh, I've been to Somalia. More women are on social media in Somalia than I'm outside of you. Somalia. I'm telling you. So I don't think you're going to find no organic girl in Somalia. Uh, find they love Facebook I'll in Hamar, in Hergeisa, in Mogdusho, Las Anod. Las they, Anod? They're on Facebook, okay? Are you from Las Anod? Yes, straight out of L.A. <laughs> I, don't, I don't mean to bring it up like that. You know That's I'm okay. Saying? I'm not ashamed. I was oh, born in Las Anod. What's the problem? No, 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 no,